Okay, here's the last one. The last five here are going to be the second round. The run course will be 880 yards, must be measured for accuracy, which we've done this morning, and set over reading ready. Then I will say three, two, one, on the go, and we'll take off. You can drop down, bounce up, and get it there, okay? There is nothing, there's nothing in the order that says you can't use energy to freaking throw that thing up with your legs. All right, throw your blocks down. We're doing ammo cans. Remember, keep them high. Let's go. You ready? Three, two, one, go! Come on. Around the outside of the last one. Around the outside! Come on back! Around the outside! All right, come on, bring it back. Around it, around the outside, around the outside. There you go. Good, lift them. Straight back now, straight back. Switch it. Switch it. Switch it. Switch it. Switch it. Switch it. 
Get it there. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> All right, you guys got two. You got three items. Comfortable feel your body. That's like the same thing with like Stephen Bay. You got two. Dude, I don't take bad pictures. Of this. About 45 seconds. We'll be switching. It's a couple. I will never do that again. No, 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 Coco. Oh, no, fun. Yeah. I just wanted I just wanted the basics down right now. Colby, were you on the end? Were you on the far end the other time? Okay, good. Here, yeah, I'll let you fill your ears out and I'll fill mine out. Yeah, I'll do it. Okay. Sorry, check that. Just no. Temperature. Temperature off, Mike. Zero's up! Zero's up! Oh, really? Humidity, 61.8. 61.8. Yeah, I'm looking at it. Altitude, 398. 398. Oh. Oh. Well, you're probably going to fail. You're probably low. Top left face, top right corner of that. Push it forward now. Push it pull forward, lock it down. Going. Kiss that second shot. Imagine that at the 800. You fucked up. Probably gonna have to yeah. move it. But I'm not in the square. I'm right. I don't need you in the square. I just I checked that, but might be able to.
this one right here, you're feeling. Mm-hmm. Should be solid. Yeah, you're feeling. Mm-hmm. Today we're shooting at 100, 300, 500, and 600 yard lines. We right now have a generic dope for our rifles. Each rifle, however, has a specific dope for that gun. So being that we're shooting at these yard lines, we're trying to figure out what that dope is for our rifles. Humidity, 61.8. It really greatly enhances our shooting skills, um, our marksmanship skills. Um, goes over all the fundamentals, and uh, it goes over just, it's really all the small things that matter with scout snipers. I mean, leaving a little piece of gear, leaving target indicators. Um, they, they train us not to do that. Um, they train us in all the little things that will help the big picture. Put 100% in, you're going to get a lot out. It's a lot of trigger time, a lot of time uh, to stalk. We're here with great instructors that will be able to answer any questions we have. So you can take away as much as you put into it. You know, it's practice. The more you practice, the better you'll get, and that's what this course offers. So. That's you. That's got to be you. I can't do to you. Imagine that at the 800. Uh, they're all good Marines. One of the reasons why I chose to be part of the scout sniper platoon is everybody, all the marines are high point marines. We're all motivated, we're all ready to do our jobs. We are doing a M249, M240 and sniper shoot pretty much. We are running the new guys through the course of fire for the machine guns and then we are going to do a unknown distance shoot with the sniper rifles. Today I feel like the training was successful. All the Marines grasped the concepts that we're trying to teach them as far as how to shoot and employ the light and medium machine gun as well as how to properly range est targets and actually engage targets using the sniper rifles. I think the biggest mindset to have is like the don't quit mentality, like things get tough, it's a physically demanding job, you carry heavy packs over long distances with a very high expectation for what your mission is. You're asked to do a lot and these guys, they have the heart and they have what it takes to just keep putting in the time and effort to get better at what they're doing so that they continue doing a better job and getting better themselves in the long run. We're just focusing in on a lot of the training that the Scout Sniper Basic Course does, stalking, land navigation, observation. We're trying to hit all these wickets and prepare these guys for potential school seats. Also, we're trying to evaluate how good they are at them after they've been instructed on how to execute them properly. Now that we have a lot of the foundations like built, we can take everything to the next level as far as like getting into mission planning, how they're going to be conducting missions, different things like that that are more directly applicable to executing a mission. We have a smaller number now than we started with, and so the guys that stuck with it and, and finished out the course, like we have, they have a really good outlook.